Hey everyone and welcome to today's video, Kevin Murphy's hair product review. It feels so much more soft and silky and I could not believe how many people had mentioned Kevin Murphy and were loving it. And and welcome to today's video, Kevin Murphy's hair product review. If you're new, I'm Jody, and on this channel we share our family vlogs, some of my mommy videos, and have product reviews from time to time, like this one. So please consider subscribing and become part of our YouTube family. And if you want to know more about anything you see here on this channel, be sure and check the links in the description below this video or leave me a comment, I would love to connect with you there. I'm super excited to be making this video for you guys today. I have had many of you ask me what I use on my hair, and I know I've mentioned it before in other videos and back when I was getting my hair colored back to kind of the mermaid transformation. I know you can't see much of the color that I had put in it anymore. I got this hair product and have been using it since and wanted to share with you guys what I thought of it. And so just a quick little background here, the other product that I have been using since, since I had my hair colored as well is Deuteris Shampoo and Conditioner. So this is what I've been putting in my hair, these scenes right here, and I love alternating between the two of them. Prior to using either of these products, for the last decade I used Pureology and Pureology almost strictly, and then the different types that they offered. And before I get into sharing a little bit more, I do want to say that I feel like neither of these helped with keeping the color in my hair. That it truly was just the water that was making it wash out faster. Sorry, my little one is hanging out here with me. I'm going to show this to you a little bit closer. So these are the containers that they came in. This is the Hydrate Me. Again, you guys, I will have this linked for you in the description below so you can check more out there. And then I was also given this little bit of the balancing wash as well. So the first thing that I noticed was I take baths and washing this out in my bath water was making my skin and my eyes burn. As much as I love this product, I have a hard time standing behind it because I didn't feel like it was the best for my skin. I like knowing that things don't have chemicals in them and this just even doesn't have the best odor to it to me as well. It's, even though it does smell really good, it's just a mixed thing where I think it smells like chemicals but it's also really good. It is the plum infused moisture and I will say that when I wash my hair with this stuff compared to this stuff, my hair feels so much more soft and silky. It feels like I am pampering and treating my hair when I use this. Whereas this just feels like I'm giving it a really good clean and then a mild little moisture rinse. But this just feels like too much for everyday use and for the price that it is, that is really hard on my wallet as well for everyday use. I am also a person who doesn't wash their hair every day. I'll wash it and style it and then go a couple days of not washing it because it is so long and I don't want to dry it out. I also wanted to mention that I felt that using this stuff is a lot more like using Pureology and this stuff feels a lot more just kind of like over the counter where I feel like I'm totally using a salon product here where here I'm using a product that anyone can just go and buy. It's also kind of funny that I'm making this video because the other day I had a friend post what was everyone's favorite shampoo and conditioner that they were using currently and I could not believe how many people had mentioned Kevin Murphy and were loving it and I couldn't help but say I love it too. Alright, I'll give you a little look here at my hair. I have been growing it out for a very long time. I'm very good to it. I do not over style it. I do not over dry it. I do put protecting stuff in it when I do style it. For the most part, since I am a stay at home mom, I am usually putting it in braids and keeping it out of my face and out of little baby fingers so it's not getting pulled and tangled. <laughs> and so that's it, that's all I wanted to share about this shampoo and conditioner. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and it was helpful to you. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you guys in my next video. Thanks so Bye. much for watching. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>